The life of Sue Townsend, one of Britain's great comic writers, was remembered in her hometown of Leicester, from where she drew much of her inspiration. It was back in 1982 when The Secret Diary of Adrian Mole was published. It went on to sell more than 20 million copies around the world. Those who enjoyed playing her characters were at the city's De Montfort Hall to pay tribute. I just quoted from the show some of the lines that she did, you know, Pandora, you've got eyes just like my dog. It's a mongrel, you know, all the great lines. You cry, but you laugh, and, and she was about integrity. The writer had been ill for some time. She suffered from diabetes and was registered blind. She died from a stroke at the age of 68. She was an extraordinary person, great uh, author, hilarious, you know, sold millions of books. You don't do that without touching people and getting through to people. But uh, more importantly, really, a really wonderfully warm, generous, witty, she was hilarious, uh, funny woman. Once a poverty-stricken single mum of three, her talents were discovered in a local writer's club when she was into her 30s. She went on to be given the honorary freedom of Leicester. Sue started her literary career at what was then the Phoenix Theatre here in Leicester. Since then, it's, it's lost that name. It's now merely known as Upper Brown Street. Well, I think there's nothing more appropriate than giving that theatre a proper name and no better name to give it than that of Sue Townsend. She famously depicted Adrian Mole, aged 13 and three quarters, as an undiscovered intellectual. Thankfully, that didn't happen to Sue Townsend. David Crabtree, Sky News, Leicester.